So we are starting from that point. Natalia, how do you do Ivan Vasilevich Lomov? How do you do? Honored Natalia Stepanovna, if someone asks how do you do, then you should answer how do you do. Don't say I am well or something. That, that's not the etiquette. If someone asks how do you do, you should also ask how do you do. Apni kya muna chen? E uttar eta hi bolta. How do you do, honored Natalia Stepanovna? Lomov addresses Natalia in a very respectful manner. He addresses Natalia as honored Natalia Stepanovna. Natalia, you must excuse my apron and negligee. Apron. Apron means a loose dress that is worn over the dress. And negligee is a loose gown. Generally, people wear negligee when a person is working. Now the question may be asked, how was Natalia dressed when she came to meet Lamov? Natalia was in her apron and negligee. Negligee means a loose gown. We are shelling peas for drying. P, motor shooting. To shell, that means to remove the skin. So they are try, may, uh, want, they want to dry the peas. Motor shooting shoot no water. Why haven't you been here for such a long time? Now Natalia wants to know why Lomov has not, had not visited their house for long. Sit down. They seat themselves. On the arrival of Natalia, Lomov had stood up. Now Natalia requests him to sit down and they both sit down. Won't you have some lunch? What did Natalia request Lomov after his arrival? Natalia requested Lomov to have lunch. Lomov, no thank you, I have had some already. Lomov politely declined the proposal. What is meant by the term decline? To decline means to disagree. Raji now. Lomov politely declined the offer to lunch. He said that he had visited, before visiting Chubukov's house, he already had his lunch. Natalia Stepanovna then smoke here at the matches. Then Natalia offered Lomov a cigarette to smoke. The weather is splendid now, but yesterday it was so wet that the workmen didn't do anything all day. The weather is splendid. Splendid means pleasant. On that day, the day on which Lomov visited Natalia's house, it was a pleasant morning. That means it was a sunny day. The sun was shining brightly. But the previous day, it had been wet. That means it had been raining in torrents. And it had rained so much that the workmen didn't do anything all day. The workmen could not work. How much hay have you stacked? Hay. Hay means dry straw. Shukno khorkebare hay. Stack means to store. Now, Loba is a landowner. He has acres and acres of land. And Natalia's father, Chubukov, is also a landowner. Landowners stock hay. Tarash khor jomye rakhe. So Natalia wants to know how much hay had been stacked by Lomov. Just think, I felt greedy and had a whole field cut. And now I am not at all pleased about it because I am afraid my hay may rot. Natalia says that she had made a mistake. What was the mistake committed by Natalia? Natalia had a whole field cut for hay. She had, she confesses, she admits that she had become greedy. Here greedy means she had become over optimistic. She had that she could stack all the hay very properly. But unfortunately, the weather had become bad. It had started raining. And now what had happened? 
all the hay was under rain water and the hay may rot to rot means to decompose poche jao i ought to have waited a bit ought to means should now natalia understands her mistake she realizes her folly she realizes that she should have waited for some time if she had waited for some time then this would not have happened but what's this why you are in evening dress now natalia suddenly notices something which she had not noticed so far what does natalia notice natalia notices that lomov is in a formal dress he had put on uh, white gloves and dress so natalia wants to know why lomov is in formal dress why you are in evening dress well i never when well, i never it means i cannot believe it our bishesh yochana are you going to a ball or what a ball means a dance party a ball is a special kind of dance in europe europe at a bishesh on the nacho che ball so natalia guesses that lomov is going to a party to attend a ball dance do i must say you look better and natalia compliments lomov on his formal dress she tells lomov that lomov looks better in his formal dress tell me why are you got up like that got up means dressed natalia wants to know why lomov has dressed in such a manner lomov excited as i have already said this character is excitable by nature so lomov gets excited at the slightest pretext khub shamanno karane lomov uttei hoye so now that he is face to face with natalia naturally his excitement grows you see honored natalia stepanovna the fact is i have made up my mind to ask you to hear me out again lomov starts beating about the bush to beat about the bush means not to come to the point but go on and on round it ashol kotha na bole onek kotha bole jao now lomov says that he has made up his mind to make up one's mind means to decide he has decided that he would ask or request natalia to listen to him patiently to hear me out means to listen to him patiently give him a full hearing আপনি আমার কথা শুনবেন অফ কোর্স ইউ উইল বি সারপ্রাইজ অ্যান্ড প্যারাপস ইভেন অ্যাংরি উইদাউট গিভিং দ্য ম্যারেজ প্রপোজাল উইদাউট টেলিং নথালিয়া স্ট্রেট দ্যাট আই হ্যাভ কাম উইথ এ প্রপোজাল টু ম্যারি ইউ লোম অফ গোজ অন অ্যান্ড অন টেলিং ম্যারি রবিশ লোম অফ সেজ দ্যাট ওয়ান্স নথালিয়া হিয়ার সেট শি উড বি সারপ্রাইজ অ্যান্ড নট ওনলি সারপ্রাইজ শি মে বি অ্যাংরি অলসো বাট অ্যাসাইড ইটস অফলি কোল্ড aside i have already said aside means this utterance will be heard by the audience so that i can shoot the baby but natalia won't hear it natalia is from china aside it's awfully cold awfully cold means very cold not no one feels that it is very cold actually it is not very cold it is owing to the mom's nervousness that he feels cold natalia what's the matter pause well Natalia is very much surprised because Lomov does not tell her exactly what he wants to say. So she wants to know what the matter is. Lomov, I shall try to be brief. You must know honor Natalia Stepanovna that I have long since my childhood in fact had the privilege of knowing your family. Instead of giving the marriage proposal, Lomov now refers to family history. She tells that from his boyhood he has known the chubukov family my late aunt and her husband from whom as you know i inherited my land always had the greatest respect for your father and your late mother lomov had been brought up not by his parents tar pita matar kache she manush hoyni perhaps his parents had died an untimely death he had been brought up by his aunt and her husband shetar marshi ebong beshomoshayer kache othoba 
kakima ba kakar kache ba late aunt late that means she has died so the mob says that he had inherited his property to inherit means to get something from one's ancestors uttaradhika sutra power he had inherited the entire property from his aunt and her husband and his late aunt and her husband that means lomov's aunt and uncle had great respect for your father that means chubukov and late mother that means natalia's mother has also died the lomovs and the chubukovs has always have always had the most friendly and i might almost say the most affectionate regard for each other and lomov again refers to family history saying that the lomovs and the chubukovs had been very much friendly with each other the two families have enjoyed a very cordial relationship dutho poriwarer moddhe ekta khub antorik somporko chilo you will remember that by oxen meadows church your burkhoods oxen meadows is a property a land so lomov says that oxen meadows uh possessed by him touches the burkhoods of natalia burkhood burk is a kind of tree burkhood means a forest full of burkhood burk trees burk gache rondo kamale burkhood so lomov refers to family history that the lomovs and the chubukovs had been on the most cordial terms with each other and he said that his property the oxen meadows bordered the property of chubukov that is the burkhoods amar shomporjo jomi ta apnar jomi ta ekdom kacha kachi basha bashi hoyeche so we have learned up to this point read up to this point i will send you the word notes questions and answers and we will discuss in the next class thank you